Hey y'all, hey. Today is Friday. I just got my flu shot at work, or at least one of my work sites. And I'm about to go grab some coffee. Then I gotta go home to work for a little bit, and then we're gonna grocery shop, okay? So then I can have this I just need to like get some quick tasks done for work, grocery shop, and then probably come back home and finish working. But um, I'm gonna need me some coffee if I'm gonna push through. So I'm gonna go ahead to this little bakery that I always get my coffee from for the low, thanks to Groupon. So I'm gonna grab a coffee from there and then we gonna, we gonna hit the grocery store and see what's tea. Because I've been seeing a few things in the Audi ad and in the Audi streets that might be worth me, you know, spinning a block for you feel what i'm saying so we're gonna check it out but first caffeine because i haven't had coffee all week i put myself on punishment and i was like mm -mm, you can't have coffee right now so i'm about to go get me a fix because it's been a whole week I actually swear by all these cars because look at that price. When cars be like five or six dollars, I be thinking to myself, I could have spent that on the gift. So come and grab your Audi card if you need it. Oh, look at that. Let's see if this one smells good. bunch of wax smells so I don't need that but it smells good and this is full moon okay pumpkin ginger snaps very pumpkin gingery I know I wasn't gonna like that candy corn it smells like vanilla so magic potion full moon yeah $4.69 mm -hmm, for sure Now, this is what I really wanted to come in here for. God dang, it's $25? I didn't think it was going to be that much. And I don't like these prints. But I saw this girl on the um, Audi group. She was buying up all of these. I didn't know that this was going to be $25. But this looks like it's a really large size, 50 by 62. I had one that I got at the end of one summer for $10. And I don't know if it broke or something but um that thing was nice they got one with this print too i might still get it <clears throat> i just don't like this plaid print i wish that it was a solid color what y'all think oh they got a bigger one too and this one's a solid color i like that solid color but yeah no and this one actually got marked down it's king size, so it's huge if it's for like your bed for you and your partner. But I'm the only person that need a heated blanket in my house. So I can deal with the little one. Speaking of, they got these other little portable heaters too. I like that it has the tip over protection. Oh, I'm ashy, ignore that. But the one that I have at my house does not have the tip over protection, meaning that if it gets knocked over or it's off balance, it's gonna automatically cut off. The space heater in my office has that feature, but my one at home does not. And that's a good price, especially since um, winter is right around the corner. Now listen, if your Pyrex is all dusty, dang, you get three for $12.99? God dang. They got the little ones too. This is nice. If your Pyrex is all dirty and you can't get the little crusties off, come and get you a replacement. Come and get you a replacement. It is for the low. We got like a whole bunch of these at my house, but I like these little ones. It's a time for me to actually replace mine since I'm telling y'all to do that. And I love these little sizes. I'm gonna sleep on it. 
I'm gonna sleep on it. I eat, I'm gonna circle the block and then I'll be back. Now, this is what I saw online. So they're calling it the awesome pot here. Oh, this lid is really light. This is light too. So this is not like cast iron Dutch oven. It's enameled as you can see on the inside. I think this is supposed to make it look like it's cast iron or something, but they got this color and this, and it's supposed to be a dupe of the, I think it's called the perfect pot or something like that. <clears throat> this is very light, but you hear the sound. So that's not bad. Let's look at the features. Free of all that stuff. You can use a stove top and inside your oven. And then this one is black for the people who like black. Now these are what I would get. <clears throat> $9.99. And you get two of them. And they're glass. Mm -hmm. Audi actually always has um, nice glasses when they come out. They got the espresso one too. That's really nice. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? If you're like really into coffee, ooh, it's glass too. And you see they got that like bronzy rose gold back there. Look at how nice that is. This would probably be a good gift for like the people who really like coffee. And I got the special mugs. There's people over here. One thing about me, I'm gonna always look for the new stuff and the sale stuff. 89 cents, lemon herb butter. Ingredients look good. I'm gonna give this a try. And I feel like you can't go wrong with this, so I might just go ahead and grab two since it's on sale. Cause this would be really good on vegetables. I like that. Something tells me this is delicious. Although making a crepe is not hard at all, but it looks like it's just the plain flavor and then you can stuff them how you like. That's pretty cool, right? But I feel like crepes are really just watered down pancakes. It's like pancake mix, so you could easily make that. These are cute. The price is $4.99. And I still ain't bought this ice cream yet. Somebody done completely opened this up so they could see what it looked like. So let me see. Mm, you can see the little pieces on it. Hmm, it's interesting. They got some fall tea collections for your Keurig. 12 wands. I about to say 12 different wands, but I wasn't sure, but it actually is 12 different wands. Oh, they got a speculose cookie tea that's the cookie that's used for cookie butter 6.99 they have these on a regular basis these little containers for your fridge but i wanted to show y'all these spice containers they came out last week they have this three pack and the six pack and it comes with labels that's really nice and then they have these bamboo canister sets for $9.99. You can hear that it's actually ceramic, so that's nice. They've had these, um, like this aisle that I'm on is stuff that came out last week or in weeks prior. So here's what's going on. And I've seen this before. I low key want to try it. I mean, I wonder if it's any good. What's the temperature control situation? Two heat and speed settings. Mm. I got these for my husband maybe like two to three weeks ago and he liked them. He said that the cookie dough flavor tastes like Oreo and the ingredients label is actually really good. You can pause it if you want to read it. But the first ingredient is dates. He said he liked them. And there are four packs in here with five balls in each one, if I'm reading that right, right? 
4x, yeah, because you get 2 and 2 with 5 balls in each to total 20 energy balls. Look at me doing math. <laughs> She's smart. What? I don't know about this. This is probably some good baby food, though. And pumpkin has a high concentration of vitamin A, I thought, but I don't really see that in here. Pumpkin squash puree. Oh yeah, the ingredients list is good though. Hmm, I suppose. Oh, you know what? If you are an egg-free girl and you're baking, but you want a little bit of that pumpkin flavor, um, you can use this. When I was baking and not using an egg as my binder, I was using applesauce. Now, I don't see the prices on these, but I have um, the canisters like this all around my house. They're airtight for my snacks. I got all of mine from um, like Home Goods. Yeah, Home Goods. I'm sure that the price here is amazing though. And they have the tall ones for your pasta too. Today was actually a very light grocery shopping day as far as like getting necessities. I only needed fresh fruit and vegetables. So I really just went to Aldi to see what was tea. Um, and then I needed to pop into Whole Foods to get some other little items too. But that's all that I have for this video. I will catch y'all next time. Bye.